Hi, this is Sohini with Double Lab, and in this video, we're going to learn how to display a simple text using APL in an Alexa skill. The first thing that we're going to do is go ahead with a simple Hello World example skill, and then we'll change our invocation name to APL text. That's what I've done. You can change it to your desired name and then we'll go to interfaces and turn our APL interface on and make sure you've built your model. Then we'll go inside the code tab and we'll find out the next part. But before that, let's go and test the skill to understand how this works. So this is basically a hello world skill where we're just saying hello and then a simple text displays in the APL screen um, which is going to say welcome to Double Lab. So I've removed the skill IO so that you can see the device display and I'm going to type in APL text in here. Welcome. You can say hello or help. Which would you like to try? Now I'll say hello. Hello world. I hope you can see the text on the screen. Perfect. I am pretty sure you can see the text on the screen right now, but it's time we understand how this works out. So let's go to the code tab and this is our index.js file. So here, if you look at the hello world in Tin handler, the first thing that we check is if the device supports APL. Um, if it does, then only we're going to include the render document directive to the response builder. So here we have checked if the device supports APL and in here we have added the type, token and document. Let's learn what these three things are. Type indicates the type of document. Token is used to identify the document in other directives and to determine which document is currently displayed on the viewport. And document identifies the name of the APL document. And I have created the welcome token in here and I've named it as text and here I've included the text.json file. Now what this text.json file is, so this is basically the APL document. Here we can specify the description, settings, theme, and other instructions. Um, in our case, we're displaying a simple text, so our type will be text, and this will be our text that we are willing to display. Well, that's all for today. I hope you learned how to display a simple text using APL version 1.6. And in our next video, we're going to learn how to display a button in an Alexa skill using APL. Thanks for watching.